Hey guys, I hope you're doing well. Um, I want to talk to you just a little bit about fasting and intermittent fasting. Uh, I've experimented with it a little bit and really what got me started on it a bit was uh, the flaws. The flaws had done some intermittent fasting and seen quite a bit of success in that. I was skeptical at first because I just thought that it, it wasn't really something you could do as a lifestyle and I didn't think I'd be able to maintain it. So I was skeptical and uh, somewhat critical at first. Um, and then I then I saw uh, Vody Bauckham had done intermittent fasting, had lost a bunch of weight. I saw some video of him and you know, Vody, I've known Vody for a long time, gone to a bunch of conferences. I've known him when he was like over 300 pounds and just really chubby and big. And then I saw him, you know, as an older man, just absolutely chiseled. And, and he's talking about that he's doing intermittent fasting. So uh, all of those things combined, Jim's success with uh, weight control and slimming down with intermittent fasting and then seeing Vody Bauckham recommended as well made me curious. And so I read a few books by doctors that were advocating inter intermittent fasting. And then, then I tried it over the summer and uh, had some success. So I've started again I, because I'd gained this weight over the Thanksgiving and Christmas. I have started intermittent fasting and I'm seeing some results and just very encouraged by it. So I'm wondering if there are any of you that might be interested in a, a small group accountability group for a little while. Maybe we could meet uh, for four weeks in a row in person and give you some information, point you in the right direction if you're interested. And then from there on out, maybe we could uh, message one another on Marco Polo or something like that. What I'm looking for is some people who want to learn about the spiritual side of fasting connected with intermittent fasting just as a, as a way to eat so that you can lose weight. I really do think that uh, there are some answers here for people does require some discipline. Uh, it does require that you've really reached the point in which you're serious about doing something about uh, managing weight and wanting to eat in a, in a more serious way to, to manage weight and uh, health and, and those kind of things, especially if you've plateaued or you have really struggled with breaking some barriers in terms of weight limit and that sort of thing. I know a lot of people go on diets. Almost er almost every diet works. Like when you start a diet, whether you're restricting carbs or where you're, whether you're restricting calories, almost everybody can lose weight for, you know, three or four weeks. The problem is, is that when you restrict calories or you go on a very strict diet, it's not easy to maintain that and even your body adjust. So intermittent fasting overcomes some of those obstacles. So uh, I would love to have a small group w together that we're encouraging one another, maybe sharing testimonies, holding one another accountable, uh, providing uh, a, a group of people that you can ask questions with that maybe know a little bit more about it, uh, some more than others. And uh, I think this could be a good thing for some folks in our church. So anyway, and even people that aren't in the church. So if you know some folks that are interested, I would love for them to uh, get back with me and let me know. We'll try to find a time and a place that's best for everyone to get the ball rolling. So uh, let me know if you think you might be interested. On another note, this Saturday at 8 o'clock, I plan to run out at UWF in the, in the trails. So if you think you might want to come run with a, with a small group, that would be wonderful. We'd love for you to join us. So where we're going to park is where we, the last time we did the big fun run for um, adoption, we're going to park in that same place. A bunch of us met there. You know what I'm talking about. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, message me. My number is 850-324-8388. I can shoot you a picture and give you some precise directions as to where we're going to meet. And so this would be good. I'm only going to run about two miles and I'm going to be super slow and I'm going to be in the, in the trails. But uh, you don't have to run the same route and you don't have to run the same distance. So some of you might want to come and just meet us at the beginning, 
pray with us briefly and then we're off. You may want to just walk through the, the trails. You may want to walk with your kids in a stroller and with a dog, you know, that, that'd be awesome. Others of you are running very long distances or you're super fast. We still come meet with us and you can run your own route and at your own pace. We won't all be together, but it'd be great to meet together at the beginning and just provide some encouragement for one another. So this Saturday, eight o'clock in the morning, come if you can message me. If you don't know where we're going to meet, we're going to meet right behind that Starbucks at UWF in that parking lot that we met for the adoption run that we did. Anyway, I hope to see you. Blessings to you. Bye.